I was working up pizza joints and whatever else, and I got tired of making just, not that it was broke, I guess, but I always had money in my pocket, none in the bank. I talked to the girlfriend one day, and I'm like, I'm gonna try this, and I signed a lot of line, and two weeks later, I was gone. My name is Leading Seaman Jason Flight. I've been in the military now, going on is exactly 11 and a half years today. I have a four-year-old, a six-year-old, an eight-year-old, the two oldest are boys. I'm gone away quite a bit. Um, when, when you're posted to a boat, you, your, your schedule depends on the boat schedule, so you kind of, you have to, um, your communications at home are better now than they used to be. We can call home a little more and whatever else. They have phones, you can call home quite often now. When, when you're home with them, you gotta, you gotta definitely gotta experience the time that you have with them when you're home because you're not always home. Sometimes you'll miss birthdays and whatever else. So you make it up when you can. So if you go into some foreign port and it's his birthday, you, you pick him up something from some or other country and they appreciate it and think it's pretty cool. Bring them on, on board here every now and then for, they do family day, sale, day sales and stuff and they love it on here. So they think it's the coolest thing ever. I'm a communications technician on board HMCS Halifax. I work within the weapons engineering department. I work on all kinds of kit, and mostly electronics, but it could vary from helping guys out with cranes because we're in charge of that stuff to guns. It doesn't, electronics are electronics. It's electronics I can pretty much pick apart anything if I had to, right? And I didn't even know which trade I was picking. I was just, they're like, these ones are all offered on the East Coast. I'm like, I'm from Newfoundland, let's go. You get in as a weapons engineering technician, equipment throughout our department, some in armament, and fire control and all different departments on our boat. Some of the communications as well, different, just easy pieces of kit to, for, for young guys to understand, whatever else, get your, get your feet wet, as well as become a sailor at the same time. On a ship or a big family, I guess you want to ever say, and you, you, you good, grow to have buddies on the ship and whatever else, and sometimes they live close to you, and you guys get your kids involved in the same stuff all the time, so when you're on ship and you go ashore with a bunch of friends or whatever else, the camaraderie, I guess, carries over to your family when you're when you're in a community. And I see people volunteering for like stuff all over the place and whatever else. So I figure I can do my part and help out with whatever I can help out with. End of the day, it makes you feel good, I guess, about yourself.